Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. It is finally the best time of the year to be a fisherman. Spring, and a warm one at that. It's actually, a, it's a freaking gorgeous day. As you can see, the sun is just cooking me right now. And we're doing something today you guys actually haven't seen in a while. We're back out on the yaks, doing some kayak fishing at this place right behind me. And what's special, I always like to fish special places. And what's special about this place is the bank is absolutely loaded with tons and tons of cover. By the way, I'm gonna try and keep this intro short. I don't wanna to speak too much. This place is too good to not cast immediately when you get here. But usually, usually this bank is absolutely loaded with pads. And today we're gonna to be, we're gonna be fishing the new grass. We're gonna be like isolating these little vines I just showed you, cause that's what the bass are gonna be on. And there could definitely, most definitely, be some bass on bed so might have to I have to catch a couple off bed plan is to just flip it's a calm day for once it's been so windy here and yeah like I said don't want to talk too much you guys don't want to hear me talk you want to see fish I want to see fish Let, let's sit down and start freaking cranking I'm so stoked I want to explain so much but I also want to catch so much there's big bass here and we're gonna be catching them hopefully we're gonna be flipping shallow grass lizards jigs it's gonna be sick get ready all right like I said we are just going to be, I think I said this, we're just going to be pushing shallow. If we see a couple on bed, we're going to cast at them, but I'm not primarily looking for fish off bed. And then, dude, this bank has just got to be one of the best I've ever seen. The vegetation, the cover on this lake, the water. Dude, it's so money. Oh, yeah. I'm literally hanging over this fish right now. I've never seen something this crazy. Look at this fish. <laughs> Look at that. All right, we're not gonna waste our time on that. Uh, is that a turtle? Yeah, that's a fish. She's circling so hard. Okay, what's the technique here? Get a, oh, I see her. This is when I get up on my seat, set the hook, die. Oh, dude, she's fired up. Oh, dude, we're gonna get this one. This is a good one, too. Oh, hooked up. Oh, no, he's in the tree. Oh, no, he's in the tree. Oh, no. He's really in the tree. This is not the fish I was after. Oh my God, this is hectic. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what in the world? This fish was not the one I've been after. <laughs> Dude, what the heck? He went straight for the tree. Thanks, buddy. This one, I don't really care about that. Uh, thank you, buddy but you were not the fish I was after. <laughs> that was so stupid, dude. That was so stupid. This one seems a little stubborn. She's big, but she seems pretty stubborn. Dana, come on, I didn't really want to fully bed fish today. Although it's a lot, a lot of fun. I wanted to focus more on flipping, but geez, if they're on bed, they're on bed, all right? Can't hate me for that. Well now, hold on a second. What is this I see? Looks like there's a little creek back here, baby. This looks sick, dude. I have to flip this. Dude, I have to flip this. Look at all these edges, my guy. All right, it smells like garbage back here. Your boy's primitive style. You know, you, you know I never have scissors on me. If you've been with the channel, I literally never have a pair of scissors or pliers ever. So, we got nature. Oh yeah. Oh, oh my God, I almost lost all my rods. Yo, dude, this hawk is about to eat our frog. Dude, no way. Bro, look at how he's looking at me. You want it? Dang it, now we can't cast. Stupid frog. Or a stupid hawk. You're not a frog. 
No, 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 no. No, no, no. <clears throat> Holy moly. Dude, no. We can't do that anymore. I'm not catching a hawk. Seriously, dude. All right, guess I got a punch. <laughs> Change of plans, Hawk has entered the chat. I didn't think he'd go after it, dude. I mean, how bad that would be, dude. That thing would have ripped our face off. Oh. Yep, that's one. Yep, no! Oh, man. I thought I got nailed, dude. Yeah, I saw him come up right as I set the hook. He wasn't big. He's maybe two pounds. That's so fun, dude. <laughs> that just reminded me how much I love doing this. People are gonna hate me for this, but it's so close between punching and frogging, dude. I don't know which one I enjoy more, but considering the fact that I am punching this instead of frogging it. I just catch it on top of like a 0.34 pound bass. Leaves me to believe that I enjoy punching a little more. <laughs> oh, boom. I, oh, I just, that was another fish, but I just saw another fish right there coming up to eat something. Holy moly, dude, what is going on here? Dude, we might've just unlocked the holy grail of spots. Oh, the... I'm on top of beds, that's what's going on. Those beds are deep, dude. That's like five feet deep. Oh my Lord Jesus, that's like a six. Holy Christ a moly. He just swam away. Hold on, wait. Dude, that thing was massive. That was a giant. It was like five, six. Yeah, that's definitely a fish. Yep, he's got it. Yep, got him. <laughs> oh, yes, sir. That's a good one, dude. Come here, buddy. Why don't you come here? Whew. Wow, he's got something going on there. Oh, dude, freaking smoked the craw. It's not that six pounder that we just saw, but it's not bad. Beautiful, thank you so much, dude. Yeah, I knew we were gonna get that one. He was real. Oh, I see one swimming that way. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm just like in my happy time right now. <laughs> oh, there's this fish every. Oh, look, there's one right back on. No way, that's that same fish. He's art. Is that? Let's see. Yeah, that's him because he just spooked. Dude, he got back on bed in a matter of seconds. I'm going to stroll over where all these beds are and see if we see one. I think you guys can probably see just as well as I can right now. Bed right there. Hmm. Oh, that's a good fish. Might be the one I just caught. This is a big bass area. We're gonna have to come back here later today. <laughs> That's so sick. We're gonna move down the bank some more. This is the officially like the jungle, dude. This is so cool. This is so cool, man. Dude, I guarantee you there's like a triple digit back in here. Yeah, that's a fish. Where are you, buddy? There you are. That's a good one. Oh, that's one. Yep, got him. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> he went airborne, dude. Holy, that man went full airborne. He's been waiting for that moment his entire life. Ah, oh, thank you, buddy. They all seem to be about the same size. These look like Florida fish. That's what chilling in this vegetation does for them. Thanks, buddy. Woohoo! Gotta love that flipping bite, dude. That is so good. This is so sick. It's like redfish fishing, but for green, for, for like green redfish, if that makes sense. Which it doesn't, but you know what I mean. Oh.
Oh, he just hit it. So close. Oh yeah, he's got it. Yep, there we go. Oh my god, he's ripping drag. He's good, dude. Wow, he's a lot bigger than I thought. Oh, come in here, buddy. Yes. <laughs> Let's go, dude. He's a lot bigger than I thought. He's pushing three. Look at that hook set right in the top of the face hole. Dude, that's a good one. Super pretty one, buddy. All right, go back there. Go back and protect that bed. I don't know what it is with these fish, but as soon as you release them, they are like right back on their bed. And I usually, I don't like to try and catch them when there's bluegill, bluegill around and I don't see any bluegill. I think we're good. <sighs> nice, dude, we're killing them back here. I told you, this is like the swamp of fish. We got a little more grass to cover and then we might move, move back down another bank, but I don't know. It's going good and we got a lot of daylight left, baby. I saw some ones earlier that were on bed over on the right on the other edge of this point. This water's really freaking clear. Oh, yep. We got a bite. We got a bite out of her. That's the first step. Oh, yep, yep. Eat it right in front of my face. I'm in a tree right now. Oh, 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 yep. Yep, we got him. Yes, sir. Oh my God, he's under the log. Oh my God. Yes, we got him now. Oh, come here, that's a good one. Yes. That's a good fish. He was a bluegill chomper. And also, watch this, there's a bee stuck in my tackle box. All right, there you go, he's got wet wings. It's hard for him to fly, I saved him from the water. All right, I just caught a good fish. What am I talking about, bees? Finally smoked that one. Oh, we, th we threw like five different baits at this guy. Thank you, buddy. I like the aggression. There he goes. Oh, that feels good. Feels good to smoke him off bed like that. Some people comment like, isn't that bad for the their eggs? But yeah, I, the first thing I look for, how many bluegill are around the bed? How many, fr are there fry, which are the newly hatched eggs, the baby tiny bass? And are there multiple bass on it? If there's multiple bass and bluegill, I don't mind catching one of them because the other bass can protect from the bluegill trying to eat the fry. If there's one bass, fry and bluegill, no, nah, you gotta leave that fish alone. All right, I think this is it. I think this is where the uh, the big boy was. Big girl, whatever the hell it was. Yeah, yeah, this is the tree. This is where it got hectic. We caught the one fish next to it and then there was and then there was that big fish that was pushing like four pounds, it looked like. Oh yeah, there he is. She is, it is. Sorry, what are your pronouns? <laughs> We went swimming instead, but I did end up catching one more right off the dock, off the boat ramp. While we were, right before we were loading up, I saw a fish on bed right off the boat ramp. I'll roll the clip and I just caught him right off the dock, which is a hilarious way to end a good day of fishing. But yeah, that, that's gonna end it.